Hey you, welcome back to the Edge of Awesome for another Geek Responsibly video on my top five tips for how to enjoy Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. But first, if you like this video, please be sure to click below the like and share buttons and subscribe for new fresh content. So let's get started. Tip number one. Don't or display some Star Wars themes, art, or gear. Uh, this will add a lot of fun for you and other moviegoers. Um, just have fun with it. Tip number two. Grab your Jedi robes or your Princess Leia costume. Wearing something fun or funky will add a lot of excitement for you, your friends, and other moviegoers. If you're watching this in the theater as opposed to on Blu-ray later on. But I can't cosplay. Don't worry if cosplaying makes you nervous. You can always just opt for a t-shirt. Totally fine, totally cool. Tons of people will be there. It's just more about getting into the whole the whole theme and the spirit of watching Star Wars and enjoying it for yourself and with others. Tip number three. If you're watching this in the theater, your food options are probably limited, especially your themed food options. Um, so what you can do is go with a staple like popcorn or try something very different for yourself. I'm probably going to go with corn dogs because they kind of remind me of R2-D2 with the size and the shape, not so much the color or the flavor, obviously. One thing I do want to try, and I'm going to put this out there for you, um, is to pretend that the concession stand is the cantina from the movie. Of course, from the movie. I'm going to put a link in the description below for you to get an hour-long cantina song clip. It just keeps repeating and repeating and repeating, and I'm going to have it playing on my phone at a low background volume, if you will, and just have that going. What, what is that? Because everyone's going to know what it is, they're all here to see Star Wars. No one's watching anything else in the theater at all this weekend. So if they're all gonna love it, try it. Have a good fun with it, have a joke with it. If some of your friends are lame and they don't get it, that's on them. Have fun with it. If, however, you're watching this at home, your theme food options are much better because you can do whatever you want. One idea would be to use cinnamon rolls, sort of a spinoff on Princess Leia's buns from the first movie. I, however, opted for some Chinese food meat on a stick because it was, especially Tantooine feeling to me. So I, I really like this and this is what I'm gonna do if and when this comes out on Blu-ray so I can watch it again. In the theater, of course, um, on Friday on the 18th, I'm gonna be getting corn dogs and making everyone listen to the Cantina song. Tip number four. Tip number four is themed drinks. In the theater, I'm gonna opt for an Icy. Um, again, I'm just trying to do anything different than what I would normally do when I'm there to see a movie simply because it's Star Wars. It's different than everything else that's out and that I normally see. So I want to do something different to kind of pull me away from the movie theater and more into the experience of Star Wars. Um, at home, I can do a bit more, again, just like with food. Um, so what I did was I took some champagne and took a uh, Han Solo and Carbonite ice mold and put some pink lemonade in there and then just drop those in to the champagne for some extra flavor as well as just for the theme of it being Han Solo and Carbonite in the drink. Um, I think that's really fun, cool. Again, just do whatever you can to sort of make it your own and have fun with it. Tip number five. It's always better when you team up, so grab some friends and enjoy the movie. And if your friends are too lame to go to Star Wars with you, make new friends at the theater. Um, you can always, if you're watching it at home, of course, invite people over to watch it with you, but if, if that doesn't work out for you, go ahead and live tweet the, the movie. No, regardless of when you're watching it, there's still gonna be tons of people who are gonna be interested in what you think. And while you're doing it, be sure to tag me in your comments on Twitter as well, because I would love to hear what you think. So what will you be doing to enjoy Star Wars Episode Seven? Be sure to let me know by leaving a comment below. And while you're down there, please like and share this video with others and subscribe for new and exclusive content. Thanks for watching. Okay, so who wants some champagne? Yes. Because Star Wars. <laughs>
Wait. Shit. It is, but I forgot my lot. <laughs> <laughs> Feels weird. A severed head on my table. <laughs> uh, I don't know what happens in the movie. Maybe it's a spoiler. Come to the movie. Wait. So grab your friends, and if your and if your friends are too lame, just go on down and watch it yourself. You make new friends. Find some. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> It's like a sword is farting. <laughs> <laughs> I can be like, hey. Go. <laughs> it's a weird noise. <laughs> like, <laughs> you can't drink your champagne and make a face. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. It's moving right. <laughs> <laughs> Session stand. Do, 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 yeah. do. No, I'm like cheering on something. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I think, I think people would appreciate it. Maybe some of the other people would, but whatever. All the cool people who know what's up will well, appreciate. And would join in. Yeah, yeah exactly. The, the the people who like matter will like it. Mm -hmm. Everyone else can shut off. If someone says, hey, my friend doesn't like you. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't like you either. <laughs> then you know they're your people. <laughs>